You found that entertaining. I did. <laughs> I'm sure you've lost a little more hair. You call you, you call the what did they say? The bottom line? The bottom line is we won. Okay, after that, wow. Um, three keys I talked about uh, with our team before the game was we had to out rebound we had to shoot more free throws, and we had to turn it over less. Okay. We uh, we out rebounded them, we shot more free throws, but we turned it over 20 times, which is um, a bad thing against a team like this. We looked unorganized at times, we looked scared against pressure at times, we had guys hitting the ball and not confident against pressure, but you know, I, we got attack pressure. And when we did early in the game, we just destroyed them. You know, we were we were up 10, 11 right away. We were shooting threes, making layups, and then we started making bad decisions at the end of the press, uh, at the end of the, and making bad shot, or taking bad shots, turning it over, and then they got back in the game. And so then it was a battle from there on out. I thought that, at that point in the first half, I thought we had a chance to blow it wide open. Furman did that too. They got up 20 at half and it was over. I thought we had that opportunity early in the game, and we didn't do it. We run back in it, and so then we have to scrap. And so you know, it wasn't pretty. Um, we made some plays when we had to. Guys stepped up and made some shots, but 53% field goal percentage on the road is not gonna, it's not good. And, um, I'm happy with the win, don't get me wrong, we're 4-0. Like I told them after the game, you know, 10 years from now, it's a win. Okay, and tomorrow when you get on the bus, you're gonna feel better about winning or losing. So we'll take that. Coach.